Councilmember McFarland will lead us in prayer and the pledge tonight. Councilmember McFarland. Thank you, bow your heads. Uh, Father, thank you for this night uh, this chance we have to be together. Lord, I ask you just to uh, let your will be done in this council chamber. Give us wisdom to make the decisions that will be fitting for our residents. Uh, Lord, and uh, just continue to bless this city. Uh, thank you for, for this time and, and bless it. Amen. 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 I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. Good evening and welcome to the Murfreesboro City Council, March 5th, 2009. Council members, you have before you your consent agenda. If you've had an opportunity to review that, are there any questions? And if not, is there a motion that we accept our consent agenda? So moved. Second. Motion and second on the consent agenda. Please call the roll, Ms. Wright. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilly. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. You also have before you the minutes of the meeting held on February 26, 2009. I'd like to congratulate Ms. Machado for working on that so quickly and diligently. Thank you. Go, Georgia. So uh, if anyone has corrections or did you get anything wrong? Now would be the time to uh, bring that up. If not, I'll accept a motion uh, that we accept the minutes. So moved. Second. Motion to approve the minutes. Call the roll, please. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilly. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. This time we'll consider for passage on second reading an ordinance to rezone an area along Rushwood Drive and South Church Street to OG. Move passage on second reading. Second. Motion and second. Please call the roll, Ms. Wright. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. E Mr. Gilly. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. At this time, we'll consider recommendations of the traffic manager to approve an agreement with the Tennessee Department of Transportation for Gateway Trail Phase 1 and 2. You have a copy attached. Welcome, Mr. Richardson. Uh, good evening, Mayor Bragg, Member of Council. I do have that one item for your consideration this evening. In your packet is a, a contract uh, with the Department of Transportation. Uh, this is basically something that's necessary so that we can uh, modify the funding to better represent the actual split between the state and the federal obligations for this project. And uh, as such, I'd recommend approval of this and be glad to answer any questions. All right, Council Members, do you have any questions of Mr. Richardson? Do you want to? Share with us where this particular phase one and phase two are. Uh, the phase, the phase one and two are the part is the trail around the island and also the uh, island uh, amenities and so forth itself. Uh, uh, that's being uh, completed and ought to be completed, I guess, within about a month. And uh, if you hadn't been out there, I would uh, certainly encourage you to do so. It's a beautiful facility. All right. Thank you. Any questions on this agreement? Mr. Richardson, you did say that the project will, will be finished in, when did you say, 30 days? I think looking probably about 30 days. They're completing some repairs and some punch list items, so it's moving right along. Is that all the ground surrounding the, the, uh, yes, the island and all that yeah. also? Is that going to be finished up also, Mr. Haley? Or? <clears throat> I doubt that it will be finished in uh, 30 days, uh, but we're in the process of uh, trying to get the contractor uh, mobilized. They have, uh, if you've been out there, uh, you see that they have removed uh, the areas uh, that had to be dug out. They've removed that uh, material, uh, and uh, w w the city's in discussion as to uh, uh, whether or not it was built according to uh, plans and specs originally. Uh, the city's uh, design team uh, and a uh, geotechnical firm have indicated to us that it was not built uh, to, to uh, uh, design and specifications, and uh, we're, we're waiting for the contractor to finish make the that. remedial steps to finish it. So, so I, I wouldn't want to wouldn't want you to count on that thirty day period, uh, but we're pushing as hard as we can. Thank you, Mayor. Any other questions, Ms. McCannon? Do you have some 
you've got to concur with this, or there's, I know this is a note at the bottom. Oh, the contract, it just has my general standard approval of contract language, and, and I have reviewed it and uh, uh, have signed it. All right, thank you. All right, then, is there a motion on this recommendation? I move we approve the recommendation of uh, traffic director. Second. Motion and second. Please call the roll, Ms. Wright. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilley. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. This time we'll hear from the city manager with regards to a contract change order for the Gateway Trail. Mr. Haley. Mayor Bragg, members of the council, uh, the ch uh, change order number three that we bring to you tonight consists of 11 items, uh, and this is for one of the phases of the, of the contract uh, that fall under the contract that you just approved. Uh, these 11 changes uh, total the addition of $33,869.40 to the contract price uh, of $3,745,000, uh, bringing the uh, contract up to $3,779,10407. Uh, we worked with the uh, design team, the uh, uh, the contractor, and recommend uh, uh, acceptance of these change orders, of these changes. All right. Are there any questions? Mayor, no questions. I move that we accept the recommendation. All right, there's a motion and a second. Please call the roll, Ms. Wright. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilley. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. This time we'll consider recommendations of the Assistant City Attorney with regards to the purchase of property and settlement of condemnation suit for the construction of Veterans Parkway, Phase 3A. Mr. Ives, welcome. Mayor Bragg, members of council, thank you. Uh, the, there is a small property uh, in the vicinity of uh, the Salem community where uh, Veterans Parkway will intersect with the with Windrow Road. This is between New Salem Highway 99 and the Old Salem Highway and the Windrow Road area. Uh, we're taking a, a, a small a slope easement and a construction easement from this property, but it's a quite small property. It's less than a third of an acre. Uh, we filed the condemnation suit, of course, to obtain our, our easements, and that is pending. The owner of the property has asked us to just purchase the property from him. He feels that it won't be uh, as desirable as a rental <coughs> property. There is a small house located on the property, and that it won't be as desirable with these new highways <coughs> uh, adjacent to it. Uh, and looking at the situation, uh, council or staff is recommending to council that, that you do approve uh, the purchase of this property. Uh, one of the reasons is that we have already purchased an adjacent <coughs> tract. Uh, the adjacent tract that we had, that you have approved us to purchase and we have purchased was split in two by the new road. Uh, that left that landowner with two remnants, uh, and, and he didn't feel that those were uh, uh, something that he wanted to try to work with and asked us to purchase his property. On that one, the damages that we were incur uh, incurring and we would have been paying uh, because of the way we split his property and we were, uh, were going to have to remove the rental property, rental house that was on it, uh, they were about the same amount as the value of the property, so we purchased that property. The property that's before you tonight uh, is contiguous with uh, one of the remnants from the property we previously purchased. And by purchasing the property tonight will allow us to uh, control the land on that side of uh, Veterans Parkway uh, between uh, Old Salem uh, and, and uh, Windrow Road. Uh, we think that will be an important uh, area. It's, it's fairly a uh, small track that I'm still on. I can't remember exactly how long that is. It's not a very long area. If there were multiple owners of that property, we could be faced with a number of driveways wanting to access the Veterans Parkway right near those two intersections. So we think it's uh, uh, a good and uh, 
investment for the city primarily due to uh, uh, the ability to protect Veterans Parkway in that area. The owner had, uh, has offered to sell the property to us at the tax appraised value. Uh, we, we have not had a separate appraisal of this property. Uh, for, we believe that this is uh, in line with values, however, from the other appraisals that we have had on properties in this area. Uh, since condemnation suit is pending, if this is approved, we would tender the additional funds into court and uh, obtain the property by a final decree from the uh, uh, condemning court. If there are any questions, I'd be happy to, to, to answer them. All right, you have drawings in the uh, materials that are presented to you. And we're at, you're being, we're being asked to purchase this Williams in yellow, is that correct? That's correct. It's a, and we've already purchased the Jacobs in orange on both sides? Correct. It's split by the new highway. Today that's still one track, but we have purchased it and it will be split by the new Veterans Parkway. And the, the property in blue is part of that that's going to be donated from the Marymount uh, owners in connection with their participation in the development of uh, uh, the Veterans Parkway. And attachment three is the resulting part, parcel of putting all that together, is that correct? Correct. And as you see, that would control the South uh, the, I'm sorry, the Veterans Parkway frontage between Old Salem and the uh, Windrow Road uh, intersection. All right. Other questions? If there are no other questions, are you ready for a motion? Mr. Mayor, the Planning Commission approved this unanimous, unanimously, so with that, I'll move for approval. Second. Thank you, Mr. Young. Mr. Gilley, second. Please call the roll. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilley. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. Thank you, Mr. Ives. This time we're considering any beer permit applications. We don't have any tonight, Mayor. There are none. All right. You have before you a revised list of the bills to be paid. Are there any questions about those amounts or the payees? And if there are not, are you ready for a motion to pay the bills? So moved. Second. Thank you. A motion and a second to pay the bills. Call the roll. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilley. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. This time we'll consider any other business from staff or the council to come before the council. Mr. Haley. Uh, Mayor Bragg, members of the council, I laid on your desk tonight a, uh, a request uh, from Ms. Burt with the Senior Citizen Center uh, to be uh, authorized to uh, sign a grant application uh, for, the, uh, for next year's operational uh, portion of the Senior Citizen Center to come from uh, Rutherford County in the amount of $155,000. That is equal to what uh, uh, was requested and the level of funding for this year. Uh, but we need your permission in order to uh, uh, allow for this to move forward. Is there a motion? Uh, so moved, Mr. Mayor. Second. Motion and second. Call the roll, please. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilley. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. I have before you the uh, members of the Evergreen Cemetery Board with an appointment of Mr. Evan Cope replacing B.B. Carr, Jr., who is deceased, and appoint Mr. James Patterson replacing William C. Miller. That would be to the Evergreen Cemetery Board. I make these recommendations to you. Move for approval of the mayor's recommendations. Second. Motion and second. Call the roll, please. Vice Mayor Bratcher. Aye. Mr. Gilley. Aye. Mr. McFarland. Aye. Mr. Washington. Aye. Mr. Young. Aye. Mayor Bragg. Aye. Any other business to come before the council? If not, you're adjourned.